I got an unsolved mystery for you. What's inside my computer? All right, so we're taking apart this beast right here, and we're gonna clean it. Uh, it hasn't been, I haven't cleaned it since the day we built it. Which was like, what, almost two years ago or a year ago? Like two years, I think. Two years? I haven't cleaned my computer in two years. And we brought, we bought this can of dust off, canned air, just for the occasion. Let's get started. First things first, just yank stuff out. Should I have flicked that off beforehand? Yes. Oh. Well, oh, no. I got it. <laughs> oh no. Alright. It's all good. So we're professional. Barely. Jesus Christ. Chris. <laughs> Look at this. Look at that. Look at all that crabbage. That's even worse. What? The bottom of this thing. I can't see it. Well, you're gonna see it. It can't be that bad. How much dust can collect in two years, right? Jeez, there's dust along here too. Oh, man. Yeah. Dude, we could do a lot of stuff with this dust. That's a spider! Look at this spider. It died! Look at that thing. It's deathly. Alright, bro. Alright. <sighs> gotta give him a proper funeral. Watch him be alive and he's just playing dead. Man, we need to build a coffin and everything. Bro! I couldn't, we couldn't have had fun. I could have named you. I would have named you and fed you flies. How did he die? Well, you see, when a spider lives a good long life, they get old and then they drink a lot of booze and die. Look at him. He died. Under my computer. Poor guy. I didn't mean it, man. All right, let's continue. Oh gosh, I feel like I need like a mask or something. He's about to get hairy. To collect uh, specimens. I'm a scientist. Barely. The first rule of science is you have to do things as confusing as possible. What a beauty! <laughs> <laughs> specimens of dust. That's enough uh, specimens for now. Until further notice. Let's start blowing. Oh. Whoa! All right. Start blowing. Bro, that dust is caked on there so hard. This air is not doing much. <laughs> oh! <clears throat> okay, note to self. Don't hold it sideways. I feel like this isn't coming out as strong as it used to. Oh my oh. gosh! <laughs> A whole new world. It just fell open. It was just like... A whole new world of disgusting. Scrape up some specimen here. Rule number two of science. Everything is a specimen. This part is the worst, the most, what do you, what do you call it? When it's all bunched together. I don't know. Densely packed, packed area. Oh, I didn't even see that. Is that like exhaust from the fan or something? I don't know, but it's disgusting. Where's my... Here at uh, Rotivity Labs. We only use the best equipment. There you go. Alright. Nice job. Ugh. It's gonna come out all like a sponge. It's, it's like a sponge, dude. Oh my gosh. Jesus Christ. This is like... People would gag. Gag a maggot off a gut wagon. <laughs> what? It's a Texas saying. I don't believe it. I've lived in Texas my whole life. So have I. I'm white though. I think we just doubled our specimens. More than doubled the specimen number with just this. How much do you think that is? Three grams? <laughs> <laughs> this stuff should be in a museum, dude. All right, we're finished. Put everything back together. Oh, it's all clean. Barely. Barely. Mostly. Mostly, yeah. I could clean the floor under it, but you know. Time to put it back. Ugh. Hopefully it doesn't kill another spider. You're okay now. The only logical thing to do here is to make a sculpture out of this dust. This is a utensil of an artist here. Why is there so much hair in this thing? Nobody knows, man. All right. We gotta turn this into a sculpture. How do we do it? Let's make a bunny. Dude, look at that. <laughs> wait, wait, you gotta get the right angle. That's a bunny, right? Wait. 
All right, it's perfected. Bunch it up a little bit. There, it's a bunny. You're welcome. It's a, it's a dust bunny. Get out of here. <laughs> Did you even see that one coming? Get out of here. <laughs> Check it out. It's a little bunny now. You're welcome. And I got an idea for it. We gotta, we gotta solidify the sculpture in, oh, pres in oh. its presence. Hold on to this. Oh, you're gonna get that all over your computer, and then you're gonna be sorry. Nah, cause your computer's gonna be stiff. <laughs> if you spray it with hairspray. It solidifies the sculpture. At least I think. I don't know. I'm no scientist. I'm only a scientist. All right. Ta-da! Perfect. You're welcome. What are you doing? Making a little casket for us, the spider for biscuit. You know, he deserves a proper burial, so I'm making him a little casket. A That's tiny one. Good. The size of my finger. You're welcome. But first, we have to cryogenically freeze him. Take his DNA out. Bro, you right? I'm making a casket, man. Doing a little bit of finishing touches. There's not a mess over there, by the way. All right, so this is our casket for uh, the spider we found. Check it out. Now, we're probably going to tape the side, but it's all red in there. Doesn't that look nice? Barely. I'd like to die in there. All right, ladies and gentlemen, here we are today in honor of our good spider biscuit, which we are putting into this Spider-Man casket. There he is. Wow. Wait, so peaceful. He's in there. Sorry, Biscuit. Sorry, Biscuit. All right, close him up. Sad day. So should we like bury him? Give him a proper burial, or like, or should we give him like a Viking's funeral? Just yes. Okay. <laughs> we have Toby up in here. <laughs> the door opened by itself. I legit. I heard the doorknob twist. Open by itself. There's no one in here. Wait. Did you? There's no one in there. Like. What the heck? What the heck? Cole, we need to get out of here. We need Can't to get out. We get haunted in here. This biscuit's ghost. Come back to life. We're sorry. Sorry, you won't go even find We're giving you a proper burial. What more can we do? All right, we made a little paper boat that we kind of tried to waterproof with tape. We're just gonna send it off in a pond and light it on fire and hope it floats. I'm gonna give it a proper Viking funeral. I'm gonna set her off the sail and light the boat on fire. Any last words? I have some last words. Okay. Thank, oh. Okay. Thank you, Biscuit, for being such a daring spider to live in such an, an atrocious place. You are my hero. You were a spider, super spider. That's why I made you that casket. Unfortunately, we don't have a big river, and all we used was a tiny pond. <laughs> Alright, <laughs> uh, and uh, so I guess we're gonna have to bury him for real, because we can't just leave him there. We at least we tried. Yeah. And I'm not bragging or anything about my boat making skills, but this thing is still seaworthy. I'm just saying, even though it's only half here, check it out. What's up? So before we bury this guy, I thought we'd make a little bit of preparations. You know, for the future, when we have better technology, we might be able to revive him. Uh, but for now, we're just gonna extract some DNA and then cryogenically freeze him and then we'll bury him. Got some equipment. We're gonna, about to make the extraction here. All right, you're just gonna open him up real quick. Oh, okay. His charred remains. Nah, he's still fresh. Yeah, he's still good. He's, he's not charred or anything, he's still fresh. You can make a quick extraction real quick. All right, nice and easy now. Easy does it. 
I think we're getting some. Oh, oh. See that? We got it. We got her DNA. Now we're gonna cryogenically freeze her using the most advanced technology. Now that her DNA is, now that she's cryogenically frozen, we can stick her back into her casket here. Uh, break her off. And she should be safe now. Now that she's cryogenically frozen, her DNA is well preserved. Let's give her a proper burial. Now we have to dig a hole for this, for biscuit, spider. Got a shovel. Let's do it. What a sad day. Yo, man, you've been digging for a while now. It's been like 30 minutes. You almost done? Almost. All right, I'm done. <laughs> Took you forever, man. I know. All right, let's see. Wait, is, is that it? Is that, what? That's it. What is that? It's a spider hole. Man. <laughs> You've been digging forever. <laughs> you got a tiny hole. It's my masterpiece. Such precision, you know. <laughs> you know, that's <laughs> technique. That's all I can say. Sorry to see you go, buddy. This is your last day here. Oh, what is that? It's another. It's alive. <laughs> Guess Biscuit's family came to visit. Probably. During the ceremony. All right, it's time to lower you in. You had a good run. There you go. Gonna cover him back up now. Going home to your mother. Ain't no more guns in the valley. Going home.